What up? If you think of a good football club, you're definitely not thinking about Barnsley. Today, we're going to rebuild Barnsley, boys and girls. And fun thing, they have only won one domestic cup in their entire history since 1887. So today, we have a couple of missions. First, we need them to win a league title. Second, we need them to win the Champions League. It's going to be very difficult for us today, but let's see where we can end this. So let's have a look at what we're working with, man. Okay, they did they, they, Okay. They're all 60 rated players on the squad, which is, uh, I don't know how to feel about that. But we have a lot of 60 rated players on the bench as well. Definitely good. We have a budget of what? 5 million. And the youth talent player. Please say he's a striker. He's a striker. He is actually a better center back than a striker. So we, we're just going to put him as a as a center back, man. Why not? A center back with 89 in physical and 74 in pace. That's definitely not bad. So I just learned that it's a very young team the team we have here but the potential is very bad Luciano Rodriguez joining from Liverpool hopefully uh, yes he agreed on the terms uh, great joining from Liverpool not the English but the Argentinish I believe I have no idea maybe the Colombian I have no idea I don't care he's joining from Liverpool coming on to the right wing here and this is the last player we are bringing in for the season we have basically just rebuilt the entire team okay if we will have a look at all the transfers we have done and some of you might be mad because I believe Barnsley have been promoted to the championship but first of all we brought in Leandro Mogala we have so Phillips Norwood Russell Benson Anderson Kitching, Odua, Wolfe, Cole. Then we have bring in, bring, then we bring in this guy Andy Dioff, uh, Luciano Rodriguez. Uh, then we have just in this new guy, Jason Van Duven, I believe it's pronounced. And then we have brought in Diego Moreira here. So we have basically just rebuilt the entire squad, if um, if that makes sense. So uh, we can take out Shorhe and put in Van Duven, and we can take out Martins and put in Moreira here. Um, that leaves us with the. Uh, enough players on the bench i believe this is a pretty decent squad uh, to play with for the first season i believe what is not one of our own players he is on loan so um, next season it's definitely going to be interesting to see what we are going to deal with there but mogala and what is called mccarty is going to have a little and thomas is going to have a little you know rivalry going on here three guys to see who is going to grow the most to get the most play time so um yeah this is the squad for the season yeah even though we rebuild the entire thing hopefully we can win the league so this is not something i normally do but we did some youth scouting here right and we are just going to loan out fabio Jalo here for two years but we, we 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 got this guy he's he was 65 rated right or 64 rated cam player we loaned him out for six months uh, to montpellier just because we cannot play him right now, but I believe he's going to be very good in the, in the future. He has potential to be 94. You can see this guy, King, Toby King here, 66 rated. We also got this Hoxon guy uh, we have loaned out. And we also got this beast right here, Nathan Cartwright. Cartwright, he's worth 2 million. Um, so unfortunately Mogala we're probably not going to use you mate um, probably going to we could loan you out man we, we could loan you out Cartridge McCartney definitely not going to but we are playing with uh, Cartridge right here so uh, maybe we can loan out Morgala could be very nice if we could we have a lot of these things right here Maybe. Are we going to lose out on a lot of players now? So it is now the end of the season and we are unbeaten in April here. Did the, 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 the league finished early this time? Let's have a look. Did we get automatically promoted? We did. Okay, we're going to the championship, man. FA Cup? No. Cabal Cup? Maybe. No. Papa John's Trophy? Could be a shout though. Could be a shout. Okay, no mind. Let's have a look at the squad and let's have a look at the players we have loaned out, okay? So, uh, Van Duven up to a 71. Holy shit, man. 68 on what's this? 72, 73, 71, 76. 69 on this guy, huh? 69, okay. 69, 73, 69. Okay, so pretty decent. Oh, we don't have any on the reserves, though. We do not have any reserve player. Okay. Let's have a look at um, 
the stats first of all. Okay, Lucas, uh, Lu it's not Lucas, Luciano Rodriguez, 21 and 9, decent enough. Van Duyven, 21 and 6, decent enough. Tedic, 11 and 1, okay. 7 and 5, 7 and 10, 7, okay. Let's have a look at the players we have loaned out. First of all, Jalo, you have grown by 4 men. Ah, it's impressive, impressive, impressive. Hudson, he has not grown since we loaned him out. And Toby King has grown by 2 since we loaned him out. Pretty decent enough. Let's have a look at Morgala. He has also grown since we loaned him out, which is absolutely great. So we do have some players coming back from uh, from loan now. Um, you can see we also have a left back coming back, Styles. So that leaves us with another 1.4 million so we can sell Caden or maybe just keep him, you know. Uh, but this guy, he is very unhappy. He has been approached by young boys. Do young boys want him? You can have him, man. So, uh, yeah, this is... Uh, that, that was this season, a uh, pretty, pretty decent season. We are going to the championship, man. Here's Hulk! Dini! Let's see what we're working with here, man. Shaw, only 65, needs to upgrade him, man, needs to upgrade him. 30 million dollar budget, we got this. So, we have done a little bit of transfers here, man. Okay, and if you want to see it, I believe it's pretty good with the 13 million budget. So, we brought in this guy for 9 million. He's now worth 14. His contract was running out. He's grown one rating in one month. Absolutely phenomenal, boys. He is uh, 77 rated now, so it it has a lot, of, um, a lot of good players here to the squad. He's actually the highest player, almost the highest player on the squad. With Graham, so um, this is the squad we will be playing in the championship. Hopefully, Collins can grow, and uh, otherwise, I'll see you there. Yep, boys, you can see it is the end of the season here, and we have won the playoffs against Fulham apparently on penalty, which is great. Which means that uh, we are in the Prem next season, which is absolutely magnificent. Not really happy about it because I don't know what the fuck Southampton won the FA Cup. Okay. Cup out, cup, we were not in it. So let's have a look at the squad. How are they doing? How, how, how well, what's up with them, man? You can see 80 and 79 on the attackers. Really good. 80, 78, 80, and 75. Decent enough. 75, 75, 82 on Graham, and 73 on Williams, 73 on Collins. I mean, this squad is pretty decent, I would say. Magala, you are 72. That's good. King, 72. Pretty decent bench we're building up here as well. Um, we're going to get a lot of money for the next season, which means we can upgrade probably right back, uh, Styles, maybe Colonel. I have no idea. So uh, let's have a look. Van Duven. Scrum by 7, 24 and 2 here. Georg Kores, 22 and 10, 11 and 5, 9 and 4 from Moreira. Pretty good. 7 goals from Oli Shaw, pretty good here. And Graham from the center back, 6 and 5. That's pretty good, man. That's pretty good. So let's jump into the Prem, man. So believe me, guys, I've done a lot, a lot of transfers here. And we had a budget of only 51 million, so I had to sell the player, man. Graham, Jordan Graham, man, you have been a pretty good player for us. But I needed the money, man. I need the money. So first of all, we have brought in Rasmus Christensen for the right back position. We have loaded out Toby King. We have brought in Benjamin Pavard. Um, we have sold McCarthy, sold Collins, and then we have brought in Cohen Castiles for the goalkeeping position because we cannot play with a 73 rated goalkeeper when we are in the freaking Premier League, boys. So, um, this is the squad we have now. I believe, uh, I, I don't know what to believe, man. It is the end of the season here in the first season in the Premier League, actually. And uh, the manager rating is still looking decent enough, I would say. Let's have a look at the standings here. Okay. We came ninth. That's pretty. That's pretty. That's good enough for me, man. That's good enough for me. The FA Cup, no final. Maybe the Cabal Cup. Nothing. I'm first. Came in the Cabal Cup and lost on penalties. Wow. Let's have a look at the squad here. Okay. <coughs> I'm sorry. 83, 85, 82, 85, 85. Decent enough. And then our defense here is lagging quite a bit. 78, 77. Um. All right, Castile is injured though. That's that's not great. That's really not great. We probably needed him in some of our last games. Uh, yeah, is how it is, man. It is what it is. Let's have a look at the goal score. Van Dieven, twenty-seven and five, decent enough. Seventeen and three from Gyokores. Gyokores, 
10 and 9 from Rodriguez, 8 and 13 from Diego, and 4 goals from Rasmus Christensen. So uh, that's decent for this season, boys. It's decent for this season, but um, next season we need to upgrade the squad even more. Yep, not a lot to do, man. Not a lot to do, but we still got something done. We loaned out a Mogala and we have brought in Yusuf Fofana for the center defensive midfielder because we only had 50 million once again in the budget. So the defense, you have to wait just another season. But otherwise, I would say the mid we are pr looking pretty good at the midfielder here and the attackers are also looking great. So now, uh, I, be I believe it's just the it's, it's just the defense, man. And then, then we are off to a good start here. End of the second season in the Prem, man, and let's have a look. Let's have a look. Are we playing Europa League next season? Or Champions League? Okay, we are playing the Europa League. Nice. Nice. That's that's good enough. That leaves us with a bigger budget then. Uh, in the FA Cup, not a final. Kabaoka, probably not a final either. No. Okay, so let's have a look. Have the squad grown, though? Have the squad grown? They have a very nice from the team actually very very nice pretty good looking squad now um, Yeah, pretty good just need a new left back and a center back and who knows what more I have no idea 30 goals though from Jason van Duven. That's pretty good Gilgores with 21 and 7 Rodriguez with 14 and 10 8 and 9 from Diego and 3 and 5 from Fofana so um Good, 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 good season here. Very good season here. Castiles is soon to be 87 rated, which is absolutely phenomenal. So, um, yeah. Let's see uh, what, what budget we have next season. Okay, it's the end of the transfer window here. Oh, we have done some transfers. And I have just come back from getting a new ha ha haircut, man. So that's good. And uh, we have done a whole lot of transfers, man. We have sold Toby to... No. What the fuck, man? Toby King here for 15.7 million, and we have brought in Malik Tiaf for um 35 million plus a cut, right? Which is absolutely sad because it only been a month since we bought him, and um he has already become 25 years old, which means we could have gotten a little bit cheaper. But um it is what it is, boys. It is what it is. We do not have a lot of money to spend each year, so uh, the left back styles you are still going, mate. You're still going. And uh, this is the squad we will be playing with next season. It's probably the season we're going to sell Castiles. Because then he will not grow anymore. It's the last year, uh, before he ages again, uh, where he can grow. So uh, absolutely great for us. Now we also have to worry about getting a new goalkeeper. But uh, this is the squad, man. It's, it's the squad, man. We have a 75 rated out on the bench. I haven't even noticed that, man. Uh, oh, now we have a 72 rated. What is going on with me? So... That's the squad we will be playing with. We are in the Europa League, I believe so. So let's see where we can end. So at the end of the season, we only have two dubs in here. So uh, let's have a look at the standings first of all. Uh, let's have a look. We are third with Wolves as fourth. I believe that only one season ago they got relegated. Wow, impressive from them. Very impressive. Aston Villa, Brentford and Norwich got relegated this time. Okay. In the FA Cup, we lost in the final, okay. In the Carabao Cup, we was not in the final. And we played Europa League, so let's have a look here. We came number one in our group. Then we beat... Um, am I blind to see us? Or we did, maybe did not even play here. Um, in the round of 16s, we were up against uh, Marseille. Where we won 3-1 aggregate. We won 4-0 aggregate against Leverkusen. We lost 3-2 against Inter. And they are now up against Leipzig here. So decent run enough for us here in the, uh, the Europa League. Which is going to give us a big budget for the next season hopefully. The squad. Oh, holy shit. What the flip man. 87 and 94. 87, 92, 91, 86. 80, 84, 86, 82 and 87 on Castiles. Holy shit man. What is this squad man. Holy fuck. Let's have a look. Van Dieven, have you have grown quite a lot this season, haven't you? You've grown by okay, grown by five. That's that's normal enough. Thirty-five and four, pretty good season from you, man. Twenty-four and eleven from Luciano Rodriguez. Fourteen and five from Gioqueres. Um, thirteen and fifteen from Diouf. Eight and six and three goals from Malik Tiav. Um, pretty good here. 
really really good um let's just see what budget uh, we have next season maybe we can upgrade a lot of the players we already have we'll see man so hear me out boys hear me out okay hear me out we have done a lot of transfers this time first of all we have brought in Sergio gomez instead of styles uh, plus 26 million we have brought in malo gusto here instead of christensen for the right back position and then we have brought in jan oblak instead of castillos and we just made a one-on-one -on -one, uh, trade for them because oblak is 90 rated which means that he is probably not going to drop three rating this season so he would still be better than castiles that was just my mindset behind the the entire thing here so uh, this is the squad we will be playing with the power is looking all right i mean it's okay good and the attack is absolutely phenomenal so uh, i believe this is the squad we will be playing with and let's get it to the champions league final and I told you boys, I told you, we have a Champions League final against Real Madrid. So let's check it out man, let's check it out. First of all, in the Champions League we came number one in our group. We then beat Borussia Dortmund, we beat Bayern Munich and we beat Manchester City which is absolutely phenomenal. In the Premier League, oh, what the flip? Seventh? That's bad, that's really bad. In the FA Cup, though, um, we lost to Manchester United, okay? Cabal Cup, no nothing, no nothing, man. Okay, let's have a look at the squad. Is it that bad? Is it that bad? 90 and 95, 89, 95 from Diego. 92 on Rodriguez, 87 on Fofana, 84, 86, 87, 85, 89. I mean, the squad is looking good, man. Why can't they? They, they, they are not supposed to be 7th. Holy fuck, man. Okay, let's have a look here at the stat, though. 28-2, uh, and two, decent enough. 22-2, decent enough. 21-8, and eight, that's good. That's good. 7-9, bad. 5-5, five and five, bad. Oh, he's a left back, sorry. 5-3, uh, and three, good. Left mid, 5 goals, but 16 assists is approved. But for only 5 goals, that's not good, man. That's not good. Um, so, yeah, it, it is what it is, man. Let's jump into the final. So this is the squad they're playing with. They're playing with Vinicius, Alessandro Martinez, Wimmer, uh, Vitinha, Palacios, Chouamini, Fanderson, Marquinhos, Miltao, Hakimi, Quatua. So basically they just went out and bought the best players in the possession in season one. So uh, let's have a look here um, if we can. We won on penalties, boys. What is this, man? What is this? Okay. Uh, first of all, Rodriguez got swapped up with Fabio Jalo, who I believe is 69 rated. Wimmer then scored to 1-0 and then Van Duven equalized in the 89th minute. Then it went on, Van Duven with a penalty goal scored, then they Kashmarek, I have no idea who that is, scored. Then Sergio Gomez scored, left back, Lautaro Martinez scored, then Gioquere scored, Vitinho scored, Fabio Jalo he scored man, that's pretty good, Palacio scored and then Fofana scored, that's last And the guy Paolo something he, he missed, so pretty good for us here, really good for us We have won the Champions League with Barnsley here man, something that probably never will happen But never say never boys, always believe in yourself so I basically just finished editing the entire video and uh, I saw that we forgot to win a title. So I have done some transfers man, Powered you are out, Bastoni you are in, Alfonso Davis you are in. Okay, Gomez you only had one season and you won the Champions League, absolutely phenomenal. This is the squad that will take us to win the Premier League. Okay, let's get it. Let's have a look here. The manager racing is looking absolutely horrible. But let's have a look. Did we win the league? We did, boys and girls. Absolutely phenomenal. 89 points, 5 draws, 5 losses. Absolutely good here. We don't even want to look at anything else, man. The squad looking pretty good. Who was the goal scorer for this season? 33 and 9, 27 and 6, 18 and 5 from Luciano Rodriguez, and 12 and 13. Alfonso Davis actually with 8 and 7, and 6 and 10 for Moreira, and Fofana with 10 assists as well. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. We finally got both the trophies. See you guys.